Okay guys, welcome back to our Project Zomboid CDDA challenge. Um, yes, the petrol station, gas to go. We're taking it over. So, we need to fortify it, and the first protocol is wood. We need lots and lots of wood. So, I'm going to chop down the local trees, clear out all this vision, and start fortifying. So, let's get cracked on with it. Okay, there's a few more zombies in the local area than I was expecting. Uh, seems as if the respawn is happening. Game. Just means more killing. Easy peasy. Well, that seems to be all of them in this little area, so we'll get cracked on. Get these uh, trees chopped down. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, we've got some friends whilst doing that. Uh, not great, because we're knackered. It is only two of them, we might get lucky. Not good. Come on. Thank you. There we go. That could have been a lot worse. Well, we've opened up this area quite a bit. And I think the zombies are just migrating through. I don't think respawning. But I could be wrong. Let's hope I am. We already got rid of everything in here that's not of use. So we are kind of safe inside. We might as well rest up for the moment. This exhaustion just doesn't want to shift. This is not good. Maybe I need to make a chair. I think that's going to be a good idea. Let's have a look. What do we need? Five planks and four nails. I've only got one nail on me at the minute. The rest are at the uh, the bar. Oh dear. Hmm. Wonder if the toilet will uh, work. <laughs> no, probably not. But hey ho, we're gonna uh, rest up here. We'll continue tomorrow. Uh, I woke up in a panic. Not quite sure why. I think we're. Relatively safe in here. I may be wrong. First thing I did um, after last episode was I uh, barricaded up the back of the place here. I think the other one's in the same sort of situation. Near enough. I need a crate and to remove that door. But aside from that. Okay, let's head back to the bar. Yeah, might as well take out these straggler. Huh. Oh, good knife. And that's another one down. Yeah, I've swapped over to using my other mouse again. As, uh, as you can tell by that random double click then. Didn't mean to do that, but hey ho. Right. Hasn't got an alarm, so that's good. Got another straggler over here. And that one's down. Nothing useful on them. And another one. Hmm. I wonder if these have come out of the tree line. It'll make more sense. But Spear's making short work of them. Is that... Yeah, there's another guy there. Ah... Oh well. Of 
Come here, you. There we go. Ah, bread knife. You win some, you lose some. It's another big group. There's another big group. How big? Quite big. And another one there. Oh, I think they are respawning. I think they are. Damn. So that's three there. That's it, you come to me. There we go. Okay, you two can stay down there. Or can you? Let's have a look. Yeah, there. Uh, excuse me. Sorry, mouse is being silly. Has he got something in him? No? I thought the guy there with the hat had something sticking in him. Nope. We've got another guy here. And up there. Okay. This is annoying. This is very annoying. Hmm. If I go through this tree line and there's a group over here. And the game hates me. Right, got some interest from one of them, but there's more outside. Ah. At least the spear's doing short work still. Five more there. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna ignore them. If they'll let me. Should do. Sneaking is a little bit better now, so it should let us. Ah, we got one of them on us. Yep. Goodbye. Oh, military boots. They could be handy. We'll have a look and see if they've got any holes in. Right, let's climb back up this rope. Please? Yeah, there we go. Okay, I'll rest up and then we'll continue on. Right, well, we've rested up, that's good. Let's have a look at these military boats. Ah, uh, they have got a hole in them. That is a shame. Never mind. Also as well, yesterday I disassembled everything in here. I think I've picked up all the nails. Let me just double check. Uh, hinges and doorknobs we can come back for if we ever want them. It's only the nails we want. And yeah, I think that's all of it. Okay, so... Water bottle's fine. Let's head back over. We can use the fog to his advantage again. Have they moved up? They have, haven't they? Uh, I wonder if I can get by him. No, didn't think so. Thank you. It's not alerting them, is it? Oh, it's alerted one. Hard hat. Do we want a hard hat? Hmm. Oh no, I thought it was a hard hat. Right, let's head back over. I'm going to head this way, hopefully not attract any of them. Although we want to rack up the kills, I'd rather train up the sneak. Because we're already nearly three and a half. So, that's gone really fast. Right, we didn't lower any. And, yeah, not looking too bad. Might as well stop sneaking. Save some stamina. So we have got a very heavy load at the minute, understandably. But we can get all this dropped off, and then it's building. Building, building. 
Look, there we go. Got one just randomly walking down. I think it's migrating to fill the space. I don't think it's a respawn. Hmm. Either way, I don't like it. Not, not whilst we're this exposed. Also having a group there now is absolutely ridiculous. Hmm. I don't like this. Right. Okay. I'm going to do some inventory management. Okay. That's that sorted out. Uh, yes. Now. We are running a touch low on food. I wonder if we can do a quick run. Top ourselves up a bit. Right, I'm going to go up here. I'm going to see if I can get into the restaurant thing. That wouldn't be bad. Okay, so I've just had a little bit of a break and I've reorganised my office a little bit. So my microphone is now in a different location. So. It may sound worse, it may sound better, I do not know. We'll find out as uh, as we progress. But also, um, Zomboid has decided to update in that time period, so I don't know if um, they have decided to patch out the um, low fence, create low fence thing. So if they have then obviously that kind of puts a massive spanner in the works for this base which uh, is yeah fair do as we've, we've still got his lake base and everything like that but again I just I love I love this this location I don't know why I just really really do but if it comes down to it it comes down to it if not then yeah uh, yeah there's a couple more there than I expected right uh, we've only got one spear on us, that's a bit crappy. But we we could do with getting some food. And we might go a little bit further up the road as well to the bookstore. So I'm going to start sneaky sneaky and we'll see if we can get into the place. Hopefully undetected. I mean we've got the fog to help us out at the moment. And it's just up there isn't it? There's a big group there but hopefully won't be anything inside the place. I can't remember if we've run into it. I don't know. I don't know if I did or not. But yeah, the door's broken down, the windows are broken. There's the guy outside. Uh is there a back door on this one? I don't know that either. Wow. Well, we'll find out. Oh, we've got a friend. Hi there. Goodbye there. Uh, we've got another one coming for us. Hmm, yes, there is a back door. That's a police officer. Okay, I'm not really liking this. Fighting with my uh, back exposed like that. Oh! But what I am liking is a bulletproof vest. Yes, please. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I know I equipped it, but I'll do it in a moment. Wow. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, and that replaces this long sleeve. That'll, we'll put those on as well, actually. Hey, well, I feel a little bit safer. Love the bulletproof vest. I can get my words out. Not bulletproof vest. <laughs> okay, we've got some rotten food, so we're going to take it all. Because, oh, and a sack. I was thinking we uh, forgot a sack from the other place. Uh, sugar, yes please. Extinguisher in a bucket. No, I'm alright. Ah, mustard. Yes. Uh, another sack and some more potatoes. Kitchen knife. Yep. Empty bowl. Bowl and a fork. Yes, I'm going to take them. 
I'm going to take them. Uh, it's mine. Need some meat. Are we full? No. I was going to say, I bloody hope not. Oh, griddle pan. Yes. I know this seems like a lot of just random junk, but it is needed. All right. I'm going to have a, uh, a quick drink. I'm going to fill up the water bottle. And I'm going to just quickly have a look, see what we are carrying at the minute. Yeah. Okay, right, so we're on 14 out of 27, so not too shabby, really. Yeah, I think uh, I think we continue up into this restaurant now, have a look in there as well, and we'll see if we can get to the bookshop. Because that would be wonderful to get into that place, see if we can find some knowledge. These things are taking far too long, we, uh, we need a bit of help. Oh, painkillers and a magazine, wonderful, thank you. Yeah, old Kevin here's not doing too bad at all. He's really come out of his shell. So, let's sneak around here. Let's hope there isn't too many around this corner. Or in these trees. Nice and slow and steady. Ah, no. It's a lot. Oh my god. That's a lot. Jesus Christ. How many are following? Hopefully just this one. Hopefully. Oh my days. There's ones inside as well that I've disturbed. Uh, yeah, I don't think this restaurant's going to be accessible for a little while. If this spear breaks, I'm going to have some trouble. And... Oh, I don't like this. Just a few too many. Yeah, got a few more come in. Ah. If this spear breaks... Oh, it just did! No! Have I got any in the bag? No, I haven't. It's going to have to be axe time. Okay. My job is an axe man. Come on. Thank you. Right. Uh, Walkie talkie. We'll take that for disassemblies. And another leather jacket ruined. Slow's law. I really should use blunts, but hey how it doesn't matter. Um, right, let me dismantle you quickly. I don't want to risk the alarms. Anything in these guys? Uh, probably just just digital watches, isn't it? Can we get both of them down? I wonder. I don't know. Did we get it done? Yeah, I think we did. Put those in there. Is the street? Oh, no, the street isn't clear. God oh, damn it. Again, thankfully we are an axe man and oh uh, a gun and some ammo. I don't think we'll be using that anytime soon, but it's nice to have an actual weapon with ammo. Right, I think we've dispatched most of that group. And hmm. They have seen us through the building by the looks. Okay. Right. Let's just see if we can scoot round. Don't look as if we can do that either. We've just attracted him over there now. And we've got this one on us. That's a meta event. Well, meta sound even. Where are they pulling them? Nowhere. Hmm. Okay. Well, the chef seems to have noticed us. Another friend here. Wow. And a lot of instas though. Not complaining. But, uh, what was that? Oh, service hat. Full beans. 
Right. Let's just double check around us. Uh, magazine. Yeah, we'll take that. Can we remove this glass safely now? I wonder. Oh no, they've all migrated through the building. Oh gosh. Yeah, this is not looking good at all. I don't want to pull them into these trees though, because that's just going to cause serious problems. Yeah, I could do with the spear, honestly. Right, just going to go for a run. Just gonna go for a run. Yeah, we've got a couple there. A couple over there. Oh, another big group. That's not good. Uh, nothing in that. Yeah, the bookshop should be up there somewhere. So, let's just go straight for it. And what have we got that we can have to eat now? Let's try this. Try the mustard. Oh gosh, look at the size of these groups. They're ridiculous. Yeah, I'm not sure how well we're going to do with any of this. Yeah, the police station is absolutely overrun. Yeah, the bookshop should be up here. If I remember, it's on this strip somewhere. I remember it being on the main road and pretty close to this police station. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think it's this door here. Oh. Oh, no. There's far too many around here. Okay. Yeah, that's silly. That is silly. There's loads. Okay. Yeah, we might be done here, you know. This could be the end of Kevin. Let's see if we can get out of it. I'm not making any promises though. Oh gosh. The numbers are just ridiculous on CDDA. Yeah, we're getting a bit too exerted for this. I think we're just going to have to bail. If we can get through these groups without getting pulled down. Yeah, that will lucky. Right, I'm just going to sprint straight down the road now. Oh my god, there's far too many. This is silly. This is why we need to do a burn. We need to get a burn set up around here somewhere. Pull them all down, get them burnt up. But we need a vehicle really in order to do that. Well, two vehicles side by side. It's the best way, because then you can fill your vehicle up with uh, magazines and food and everything like that. And you can sleep in it, etc, etc. You can pull massive hordes to it. But, yeah, sadly we cannot do that at the moment. Now, yeah, this place is still overrun. Yeah, still a fair few in there. Okay, that should be enough for the sprinting. Oh, <laughs> the noise again. It's always the noise that gets me. Right, um... You know what? I'm going to drop his bling. We don't need it. It's just weighing us down now. It's a bit silly to have it. So, chuck that on this zombie here. And he took some doing. Another Shaun of the Dead reference with Red Pen. Ah, right, two more down, at least. Okay, uh, leather jacket. There we go. And a revolver. And a fork. Cool. Uh, yeah, right, we'll keep aviators. Clip on tie. And go. Yeah, clip on tie can go. We don't need that. Uh, we broke that leather jacket. Rip that up. And we can't rip that up because we haven't got scissors on us. Hmm. It's fair dues, but oh well. 
Right, well, we got some rotten food. It might end up killing us. We don't know. But that's all we could do. I wonder if it's clear out front of this now. Uh, yeah, just the just the one. So now we'll take this guy out. The girl. Whichever. Please go down. Thank you. Another digital to disassemble. Let's check the vehicles. Nope. What about the boot? Nope. And we have a couple coming after us. I don't really want to be dealing with them. So I'm going to head back over to base. I might end up pulling a few back over. Oh, what? I cleared that. Oh, this is so annoying. Leave my petrol station alone. Okay. Now oh, we're lucky. Nearly got trapped in the animation then. In this okay uh why does it keep opening the bag go to the earrings chuck them on the floor dog tags chuck them uh as much as i love the aviators they can go as well please thank you Another one broken. Uh, revolver, screwdriver. No, I don't want to equip you. Get in the bag, please. Have I got time to uh, grab one? Yes, I have. Thank God. Okay. It's a big run round now. This is the power of the spear, though. Accessibly exerted. Oh, gosh. it. Oh, well. Yeah. <laughs> that took the piss. But, yeah, we defended up our petrol station yet again. Right. Okay. Uh... Red knife, yeah, I will take you. So I'm hoping to put some things on the end of these spears now, because I'd like them to last a little bit longer. So I'm going to grab these ones up and put the others in the bin, because I forget that you can put stuff in the bin and then delete it, can't you? 
Yeah, that, there we go, delete all. Boom, gone instantly. Which is what I should have been doing. Hopefully it's clear in here. Yeah, like I was saying, the update, I do hope that they, uh, they haven't patched that out. I mean, it makes sense if they did, right? But I was hoping to utilise it for a little bit longer at least. But yeah, we'll put all the rotten stuff in there as well. And just sugar. In fact, you know what? Let's just empty everything we don't want. And then I'm going to see if we'll put kitchen knives and forks onto the spears. Hopefully. Grab all this duct tape. And we can attach a kitchen knife to it. Wonderful. Carpentry. Fence. Wooden fence. There. Okay, looking good. Now, that could have shot us in the foot if they've uh, if they've changed it, but if they haven't, then we're all right. I think that's enough. I think that's all we need. Carpentry, wooden crate. Yeah. Carpentry, wooden fence. And I believe that is all we need to do. And we'll pull everything outside, all the planks, all the uh, all the wood and everything like that, and we'll start a little building montage, I think. Right, it looks like that's it for all the logs we've got so far. Uh, yeah, we're definitely going to need a fair few more. Uh, right, well, I'm going to cord it off along here. And that's going to be it. And that should hopefully secure the whole thing. But what I'm going to do, instead of doing one solid one, I'm hoping to stagger them in and out. Um, because I'm hoping that... If the zombies come to the wall, I can attack them diagonally. That's probably wishful thinking more than anything, but hey-ho. Okay, it is a shame that we couldn't get into that library today. Because um, we need to get our carpentry up more. I mean, we're almost at level four, but I think it's six for stairs, is it? Let me have a look. Right. Does it even... Yeah. Stairs, six, and 15 planks per stairs. Wow. Oh, okay. So, that's going to be a lot of tree chopping, um, plank making. I mean, I can make a big bunch of spears. I can start working on this place a bit better. You know, get everything set up and whatnot. Um, I may get rid of this here so I can go outside and scout. Like maybe make three instead of just the one blocking, but I don't know just yet. It could be a good idea, but saying that when I'm up top, I won't need it. So yeah, uh, in here is just going to be rubbish. All the stuff that I don't really want that I have on me, random crap. But yeah, anyway, that's uh, that's sadly going to be it because. The only things I'm going to be doing now is uh, chopping wood and killing the occasional zombie. And that's not going to uh, be very entertaining. So I'm going to leave it there. Uh, we are very hungry. We'll, we'll make do. Hopefully I won't die from eating all this rotten stuff. Um, but we'll see how we go. I mean, look, there's an entire rotten ham there. Do I eat it? I don't know. I don't know. But we can always uh, head back to the lake 
and get the rest of the crops because hopefully they should be done by now but we're not completely out we've still got a tuna and some pop and a beer in fact let's celebrate let's have a beer a beer to send it off right anyway thank you very much again for watching i do hope it has been entertaining for you remember don't forget to do all the youtube thingies for me it's really really appreciated i'm trying to get up to as many subs as i can um i'm hoping to get a thousand straight away you know for uh, monetization and all that lot you know the the good stuff <laughs> for us youtubers right anyway so thank you very much again and i will be back soon with another video goodbye